Another leg kick there. He's already landed several in this round, and the damage is really starting to take its toll. Yeah, it's really starting to take its toll. And you watch the opponent walking gingerly on his leg, and one big tell that you're starting to really do well with your leg kicks is when your opponent starts to switch stances. Right. Watch for a stance switch very soon. There's no tell on that leg kick. Nice straight punch. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Just out of range with that left hook. Some nice back and forth action here. He blocks the punch. Big kick lands. Flips the shot. Big leg kick land. Oh, tags him with that money left again. Caught the kick. comes from him throwing that kick. Right hand upstairs. Connects with the right. Just misses with the straight left hand. Oh man, that's hard to watch. Another leg kick lands flush, and if you're the opponent at this point in time, you gotta check something. What are you doing? You gotta adjust. You gotta be doing something different, because to this point, what you're doing is not working. Get close, fight chest to chest, maybe relax on the outside. Don't panic, don't be jumpy. Try to find comfort in knowing that you've done this. You have the reps, you know how to check it. Just take your time, be comfortable. Get that leg up. It's only going to take one great check to make the shot for the kick. Time the shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Nice strike. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Short. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that off for him. Real quick leg kick. Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, a huge block there. Slips the left hand. Oh, that's a nice strike. Tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight. And that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Beautiful punch. Look at the force behind that leg kick. 
Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. Another shot lands upstairs. Well, a good sequence there. The right hand followed by the left. All right, let's get you some of the action from that previous round, DC. And those are some serious leg kicks, man. He gets the legs of the target so quickly. He gets his foot off the ground so quickly that you don't even recognize that it's coming. And that's really confusing his opponent. All right, round two is now upon us. Pretty competitive first five minutes, I thought. It's exactly what we expected. We expected when we saw this on the match sheet that these two guys were evenly matched. Let's see who really takes control as we go into the second round. Well, he has landed some good shots at DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into the strike. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of locking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. We got to whip his hip into that kick. Pretty good job staying patient as he lands the counter strike there. Strong work by the Korean Super Bowl. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Nice punch lands over the top. Big leg kick lands. Troy gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. All right, single collar tie now. Big kick land. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Come on, buddy, keep your hands up. Let's go. Nice head kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. It's such a fast leg kick. Of inches right there, yeah. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice punch lands over the top. And both guys really throwing with authority. Choi's hook shot blocked, though, by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage.
Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. You certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Switching stances here. All right, now we'll get to some highlights, DC, from that previous round. You know he's got a penchant for landing those head kicks and certainly found that form in that previous round. Very rarely do you get a fight where a guy gets kicked in the head this many times. He better make some adjustments. He better keep his hands up or he's gonna go good night very soon. All right, so another round is now underway. Pretty good action over the previous Ready? 10 minutes. Your thoughts on what we might see? Both of the guys really picking up on the action, putting their foot on the gas, and really starting to drive it home as we approach the end of the fight, and we're still so evenly matched, and the fight has been so close to this point. Visibly limping here. Good punch land. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he feels himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. Oh, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Hit him with the overhand. He has a commitment to kicking tonight and show. Back and forth we go here. Punch over the top. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fights. Oh, he hurt him bad with the jab. Right, so he lands another punch there, and he smells blood in the water going right back at that cut. Absolutely. The opponent has a lot of scar tissue around the eyes. He was able to cut it open, and now he's just touching it over and over again. Big kick land. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Oh, man. Oh! Can't take many of those. You better check. Right hand on point. It ain't Dikembe Mutombo, but he is blocking all these shots coming Man, this way. get that out of here. He sees it coming. You're going to have to mix it up. Shake that finger. Shake that finger. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Nice body kick. What a punch. Lands the right hand. Back and forth we go. 
You wonder if the offensive fighter's gonna start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Ooh, big shot land. Checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. Really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Man, he is so sound defensively. Nice job to raise the guard there. It's the relaxation that allows him to see things coming and block most of the strikes that are coming at him. Nice punch here. 20 seconds left. <laughs> Looping left hand misses the target. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. Well, what a round it was, and how about that flying Superman punch at the end of the round? Not a lot of fighters will try it. He did the execute. And it worked, right? No discouragement from his opponent to make him not try it. Why not try it? It's working. So why not try it again? If his opponent isn't careful, he will get knocked out and be on a highlight reel for the rest of time. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Out of range with that one. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Oh! Oh, big head kick land. Nice punch land. Look at him drive his chin into the opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, nice. Oh, that right hand is on point. Superman punch. Troy gets hit with a kick. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. But how about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Oh. Straight right. That's a big strike right there. What a tricky head kick. Now connects with a right. Well, that one should leave a mark. Outstanding leg kick employed there by Short. There's no give on that leg kick. And he switches his stance yet again. Oh, overhand left, no good. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Timed with the Superman punch. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing it down first with those nice outside leg kicks. Hey, 
Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Choi. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Oh, man, head to land. Ooh, what a punch. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Final minute now of round four. Great punch landing with so much power. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Going orthodox now. Connects with the right hand, pretty good punch that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Oh, and he connects with a the punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Push kick there to the body. Punch is blocked. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Twenty minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, that's the end of the round, and you see the cut on the cheek. That thing is getting downright nasty. It is getting worse here by the minute, and you gotta wonder to what extent does that impact him moving forward here in this fight? You at least have to ask the question. Well, what a round it was. Daniel Cormier, you were one of the greatest mixed martial arts athletes of all time. I'm not sure you can do a Superman punch like that, though. With my luck, I would try to push off and my foot would be slippery <laughs> wet or something. I would fall right into a knee. No, I would not try that. I don't have that ability. I'm not that free inside the octagon. Good stick. the shot. Nice kick. Oh, beautiful shot there with the hook. I'm not sure his opponent saw that one come. His opponent is taking straight punch. He's hooking right around the guard. Oh, How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after blocking shots. Relax, relax. Big power punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Nice leg kick land. Blocks that strike. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Way to hide that leg kick. Well, he felt like he had to kick effectively to win this fight, and he is certainly doing that right now. Nice combination of kicks. His kickboxing coach is feeling ecstatic right now, watching the guy employ this kick-heavy strategy. Big kick land. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to go forward. He's got to just throw everything at his opponent to try and find that punch or that kick that's gonna end the fight. There is no time for strategy. I want you 
punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? to go on the fight. Big punch lands through the middle. Beautiful body kick. How about that shin? You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Powerful leg kick lands. Big punch lands. Stand and cheer, ladies and gentlemen. What a fight. the distance as we await the judges' scorecards, but certainly a dominant striking effort out of that fighter tonight. John, he used his best weapons in order to carry him to a decision, a very clear decision, in my opinion. A great performance tonight by this young fighter. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest. 48-47, 50-45, and 48-47. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision.